Good morning from Typhoon Lagoon here at Walt Disney World. It's another beautiful day and we thought we'd go for a water park today, didn't we? Why not? I have not been here since 2019, so I'm looking forward to getting back. Yeah, we've not been for quite some time and along with that, we were hoping to do Blizzard Beach here at Walt Disney World this time. However, unfortunately, it is closed <laughs> um, for its annual maintenance. It does seem like now that Disney only like to open one of their two water parks, doesn't I've it? I've never done Blizzard Beach either. I was really looking forward to going. Yeah, I was hoping for it when we bought this trip early in the year i thought oh hopefully we're gonna get blizzard beach this time oh, yeah. uh, but uh, it's time for the lagoon again but you know what we've not been for a few years anyway and we do really like it here especially the absolutely awesome lazy river oh i love the lazy river here yeah it's nice and relaxing Lovely. along with that as well and um, you've got the huge wave pool so we get some footage of that various different slides here as well and so uh, yeah some really good theming as well so come and join us to have a bit of a relax today here at typhoon lagoon Fantastic theming down here at the entrance as we make our way down towards the entrance to the park just here. Well, it looks like we're in for a quiet day here today at Typhoon Lagoon. The storm is over, the coast is clear, so come and see the view from here. There we go, let's make our way in. Seems quiet. It does seem really quiet. And here we go then, we're now inside the park. And yeah, here's a look at the map. And yeah, the Lazy River is absolutely brilliant because as you can see, it runs all the way around the outside of the park just there, which is fantastic. And there's that huge wave pool just there in the middle, which is pretty awesome. And of course, you've got all the different slides around the edge just there as well. One of my favorites is Miss Adventure Falls. And yeah, well, of course, we'll be checking that out today. And bring you some on-slide POVs as well. We have the wave pool in here is ridiculous, it's isn't it? It's absolutely massive. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, it's always nice having a water park day. It's kind of chill out in between the parks. Yeah, we've got some lockers and changing areas just over here. Let's go and see how much the lockers are this time here at Typhoon Lagoon. Are they going to be cheaper than Volcano Bay? We'll find out. And here's a look at the locker area. Yeah, for a small locker, it was $10. So yeah, not too bad. Literally half the price of Volcano Bay. And yeah, you just pay over on the machines around there at the side. And as you can see, they've got loads of lockers all the way around. Oh, that looks nice down there. The Lazy River. Yeah, at Typhoon Lagoon. Yeah, we really like it, don't we? They've changed the rings so they're like they're not fully round, so you can sit in them. Ah, yeah, yeah, that's quite I mean? interesting. Yeah, I love they, that. they didn't used to be like that, did no, they? No, they didn't. I love that. I've never seen rings like that before. Yeah, that's so good. Yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, there is some other ones as well. Oh, yeah. uh, interesting is that. So you just sit on them. I love that. That's quite cool. Quite often they're spraying the floors around here as well, which is good. But we've got our Crocs on. We <laughs> That's a great view, looking out over the wave pool. Oh, just been sprayed. <laughs> oh, look at that. Got me, that did. <laughs> this is so about spraying the floor. Oh, that's nice, that. These are good, but they just don't move. I'm just sat there and it wouldn't move. I'll get another one. Oh, they're pretty designed though, they are, aren't they? Yeah, I like those, that's but they just didn't move. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, the water's so cold when you get in. <laughs> Just cool you off though, especially that hot you get over in the theme parks. Yeah, I do like all the themed buildings here. Very nice. It's a proper lazy river. It doesn't go that fast, this one. Not that much current. It's only a, a small current to keep you going. <laughs> I do love all the music around Typhoon Lagoon as well. <laughs> yeah, it's a proper nice relaxing lazy river, this one. Very slow moving, but that's nice. It takes ages to do a full loop round, but I like that. Can't believe how quiet it is here today though. I mean, it is a weekday in September, but still like we normally come on weekdays in September. Never seen it this quiet before. Like nobody about, probably won't be any queues for the slides, which is good. Oh, 
A little ice cream stall just over there. I like the sign. Going nowhere. Stop for ice cream. Exit here. A few smaller facts just over here too. <laughs> Oh, it's lovely in here. And Charlotte over here has got a double one there. Oh, that's lovely, that, isn't it? <laughs> that's what I like about here. There's so much variety with rings, and there's so many rings as well. Yeah, there's loads. You don't normally see the double rings on a lazy river. Yeah, that's quite cool. You can go in together. Yeah, you could sit in the front, and I can be in the back. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, viewers, these crocs are holding up better than the £2 Primark sandals. I told you they'd be good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, coming down to all these rocks, we've got the big waterfall. Charlotte's getting prepared. She doesn't want to be going under that. No, I, <laughs> I don't either. I'm actually a little bit chilly, I'm you know. I'm going to grab you and then I'll walk you through. I don't think there's a way of getting through this without getting soaked. I'm thinking that's why it's a bit quieter today because it's nowhere near as humid today, is no, it? No, it's not. Oh, no, I'm not looking forward to this thing. <laughs> yeah, I think that's probably why it's really quiet because yeah. I'm actually a little bit chilly. Didn't think I'd say that in Florida. I think it's because the sun's hiding behind the clouds. Yeah, like we've been really hot the other day. I literally had the fan out like last no. night, but just today. Oh, no. Feels a bit chilly. There's Mickey. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but there's no good way around. I'm gonna have to get out, I think. Yeah, I ain't going under that. <laughs> I wouldn't mind normally, but yeah, I'm actually a little bit cold. And we're through the big waterfall. Yeah, some great theming though around here. I do love it. You got through. Oh my god, that's so scary. <laughs> like your nightmare, that. I know it is. I have to put this on my head. <laughs> He got through. He's got to try and go through. There was a little bit of a gap. I really don't remember that from last time. Big waterfall. Typhoon Tilly's just over there, one of the dining options. And yeah, I do like how all the buildings, like all the food outlets are all themed in as well. Plenty of room though in here today, which is really nice. It takes ages to go around this lazy river. It's not really that fast, is it? But it's nice. Yeah, I like it when it's slow like this, actually. Loads of rings, which is good as well. Yeah, it took us like 20 minutes to get to this part. <laughs> <laughs> I think we might be getting off at the next one, though. And we're in a full loop. But yeah, these are quite funny. I like these. A bit different. Well, it took us about like 25 minutes to get through the lazy river there. I do like it, though. It's massive, isn't it? Oh, it's absolutely huge. I forgot just how big it was. She also forgot about that big waterfall. Yeah, actually, that was scary. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you what, though. You got through it. That's I the main thing. But so, uh, yeah, here we go. Making our way down here now towards the big wave pool. And yeah, the waves on this are massive. One of the biggest wave pools in the world, this. And yeah, I do love it. Of course, you've got the boat just up there as well that's kind of stuck on the top, which is fantastic. And yeah, the waves on this are pretty terrifying. That much so, I mean, I'm a confident swimmer. I would never go all the way down there at the bottom because the wave on this is huge. I remember once I went right, right down the side when I first came. I had no idea just how big it was. I mean, I knew they were going to be big from seeing videos. I had no idea the size. At least I went straight down underwater. Oh, no. And I was like, oh my God. Yeah, even when you're back here, you really do feel it. But yeah, it's quite nice just kind of being across the middle over here. But yeah, let's uh, wait for one of these big waves to come. And here we go then. The waves have started here in Typhoon Lagoon. So yeah, you've got like two different wave settings. We just chatting to the lifeguard about it. So every 90 minutes, that's when you get the massive wave come down. Obviously, it's just one big wave that comes straight towards you. It's pretty terrifying. And then, yeah, every 30 minutes, they do the normal wave just like this. And yeah, in my opinion, I much prefer it like this. However, it's good how they give you the option. Yeah, when that massive wave comes down, I mean, I'm a confident swimmer, like you say, uh, but yeah, it's pretty terrifying. You just get one massive wave, and you can kind of see the, the mark all down the side just over there of where it comes. Well, this is nice. Perfect. <laughs> oh, lovely. But yeah, like when the big waves come on, I'll go to about maybe this point, but I never go too far down there. 
Here it's either in Lagoon, but it's a shame about Blizzard Beach. Seems like Disney never wants to open both of the water parks now. And maybe that's because of popularity. I mean, it's really not that busy at all here today. And I say that we're a little bit chilly, but it's still like really warm. It's still like 28 degrees Celsius. But I think maybe it's the popularity of the Disney water parks like declining a little bit. Maybe that's why they don't open them both at the same time. Quite interesting because oh, this one will close and then they'll open Blizzard Beach more over winter. Obviously, it more fits with the theme that I guess for Blizzard Beach. It is quite interesting because I was hoping to get that again. I've not done it for years, Blizzard Beach. And I would have gone on Summit Plummet again and had a ride on that. Would have been good to do it. Of course, the big slide. Whee. This is nice in here though. Feels a bit warmer in here than the Lazy River. I suppose that's the thing on the morning as well. It's a bit cooler, isn't it, than later in the day. Hey, <laughs> Charlotte's back there somewhere. She wouldn't come this far down in the ways, but fair play to Charlotte for even coming to a water park. And she is going to come on Misadventure Falls as well. She did that last time. And yeah, she was okay. So yeah, she's going to come on that today. Not Chris and Gusher that after last time. When she went all the way under. <laughs> yeah, it's just nice having a bit of a water park day. Of course, in the middle of doing the theme parks. We're at Walt Disney World in Florida. Oh, this is lovely. <laughs> this is where the trick is, the massive wave comes. <laughs> no, don't worry, they wouldn't do that. Oh, time for a little bit of food then now here. Hot time for in Laguna. Yeah, just have some fries. And also, this hot fudge sundae to see. Yeah, this was 7 49 yeah, not too bad at all. Look at that when she was making it. I thought, oh, that looks good. Just kept getting better and better, Charlotte. It did. I was going to get one, but I wanted mint chocolate chip ice cream, but they didn't have it. I might let you have some of mine, though. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I tell you what, that Sunday was absolutely delicious. Really nice ice cream there. And of course, yes, we're waiting now for the big surf wave. Tends to go off every 90 seconds or so, of course, during the advertised times. So here it comes. Oh, my God. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. wow. <laughs> yeah, you go right under that. You can bump into people, you scrape your knees on the floor. It is crazy, but yeah, my limit's kind of like halfway down here. This is my limit still here. So right here, you get a little bit of it here though. Yeah, here like, it comes. There it is. Ready for the cold water. Oh! <laughs> there you go, but yeah, it's absolutely huge that is. Comment down below. Have you been in there before? On the surf wave. Oh, beautiful this afternoon. Now it's warmed up nicely and Charlotte's in this cage. This is the closest I'll get to shark diving. <laughs> there you go. Right, we're going on a slide, aren't we now? We're going to Miss Adventure Falls. Hey, you have been on this before and you were all right, I think. I can't really remember it, so I'm going to give it another go. Oh, I think you'll be fine on here, though. You've been a lot braver, though, recently with slides. I have. One that you won't be going on there over there, isn't oh, it? Oh no, Crush and Gusher, I won't do that. Yeah, you came uh, falling right into the water last time. Submerged. Yeah, let's go and uh, find the queue line. Oh, it looks like the entrance is just around the corner. There you go, there's the sign. This is like the loading area. I do really like the theme in there around this park. It is fantastic. And yeah, here's the entrance. Five minute wait for a water slide. Lovely. Hey, got the music going. Da, 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 da. It's actually got an animatronic, this one. And here we go, we're all loaded up. We are. Hey, bye. <laughs> here on Miss Adventure Falls, yeah, nice big boats on this one. And we got one, of course, to ourselves. Oh, feels weird when you go over those, doesn't <laughs> it? Yeah. There's the animatronic. Looks like we got some lobsters in the lagoon again. We got some lobsters in the lagoon. Do you like lobsters in the lagoon? Yeah. <laughs> big crane just hanging over i do like these big raft slides i'll always enjoy raft slides more than body slides that's a nice effect it'll be great if it moved but it sounds a bit creaky a bit oh i think you'll be fine on this one from what i remember you, you were okay on here and the good thing is you don't come out into like a massive landing yeah, pool that's what i don't like when you come out into a massive pool yeah you'll be all right on here Nice ride. Hello. Here we go. Didn't take too long to get to the top of the lift hill. There we go. Bye. Oh. 
We're off. Oh, we started off in the dark. I'm going backwards. I can't see anything. Oh! <laughs> I can't remember that waterfall. No, I can't either. <laughs> you are getting braver though, Charlotte. Make sure you give Charlotte lots of support in the comments. Coming on these water sides, big deal. Big thing for Charlotte. Whee! <laughs> on the sides a little bit. I can't see anything here. <laughs> Oh no, another waterfall! Oh! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh no! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> you spray us as well. Oh! Oh! Oh, there we go. Well done. Oh! That was good. Big wall under Charlotte there for going on Misadventure Falls. Oh, I did it. I quite enjoyed it actually. Yeah, even though you've got them waterfalls. What was it, three I think on there? Yeah, but because the raft's going so fast, you go through them quite fast, so it's not too bad. And there was a little gap kind of in the middle as well, so it only got you a bit of the oh, side. I quite enjoyed it. It's been a few years now, I'd forgotten about them yeah, on there. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't realise there was there. Oh, would you ride it again? That's the question. Yeah, I would go on it again actually. Oh, well, we will do then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that was good. I enjoyed that. I do like the raft slides. It's not the longest out there, uh, but it's not the shortest either. It's kind of like a mid tier. Um, slide with that one. He went up the sides quite a bit as well, which was good. Built up quite a bit of speed, uh, which was really good. Now, well done. Oh, thank you. Enjoyed that. <laughs> A slide that Charlotte won't be coming on now is Crusher and Gusher over here. I have here. done this before and last time we was here we came into the landing pool and it tipped and we went under and I was terrified. Yeah, it wasn't a nice experience no, for so you I've that. I've done it but I won't do it again no, for that reason. That's completely understandable. Now, there's a few slides here but I believe there's one of them that I can do on my own. Some of them you need to uh, ride as a two. So I'm going to find out which one that is and of course take you along with the POV. But yeah, you've got a few different slides all around here and the good thing is you can just chill out in this yeah, pool. Yeah, I'm going to wait and have a swim around in this pool. See you shortly. Hey, Crush and Gusher just up here yeah let's go and have a look so quiet here today as well so can't complain about that I love all the signage and theming here here we go it's where you get the rings just down here of course you got to carry them up a lot of steps <laughs> oh it's always the worst bit isn't it carrying up the rings especially a double one uh, but yeah here we go you got the pineapple plunger the coconut crusher and the banana blaster and yeah it's coconut crusher uh, which is for single riders as well so you're gonna give this one a go gotta carry this up the steps now <laughs> here we go bye oh cast members are great and off i go whoa <laughs> feel like being on the master blaster all on towers water park when you come on this double down whoa <laughs> oh blimey! Whoa! <laughs> it builds us some good speed. And coming out quite short. Woo! Hey! There we go. Time to get off now. <laughs> It's all right, that is. It's a little bit shorter than I would like. However, at least they've got three of them for capacity. I mean, it's really quiet here today, but on a busy day, uh, then yeah, the fact they've got three, all pretty similar, uh, is really good as well. But yeah, the other two, um, you, of course, you have to have two riders for, and that one that I did, Coconuts, um, is for single riders. But yeah, it looks pretty there, doesn't it? Which is yeah, nice. Yeah, it looks lovely. All the palm trees. The worst thing is just carrying up the rear, especially <laughs> a double one on your own up those steps. It's a big one, isn't it? Yeah, so I'd probably re-ride it with no queue. Um, but it's quite good for nothing like spectacular. Oh, uh, but still a good fun ride here at Typhoon Lagoon. Well, certainly not fine for some beds today, but even on a busy day, I think you'd be okay here at Typhoon because, yeah, there is a lot of some beds all the way around. Yeah, as much as it's disappointing that Blizzard Beach is closed, you can understand why they've only got one water park open at a time now. I mean, in the summer, that was also the case. I'm not too sure how busy it got here in the summer holidays, but um, yeah, hopefully we'll get Blizzard Beach at some point again in the future. That's because Charlotte's never been. I know there's not loads you go on, but still. Know, it'd just be nice to see it and go on the cable car. Yeah, I say that. There is also a raft slide there, which I think you'd, be re you'd enjoy a bit like Miss Adventure Falls. Oh, yeah, hopefully but, it will open when we're here in the future. Yeah, it's a longer one as well, that is, but I think you'd enjoy that yeah. quite a lot. Yeah, let's have a stroll around this way, show you some more of the pools, slides and attractions on offer here at this water park. Walt Disney World, September 2023. And you got lots of nice different restaurants all around the park as well, such as Typhoon Tilly's, just over here. All that ice cream looked good that he had then. Oh, yeah. And that's the thing I love how everything's just themed in. Very heavy storyline behind Typhoon Lagoon. You can find it online and it makes a fascinating read.
Yeah, they have a lot of shaded areas, which is nice too. There's some more slides around this way too. And who remembers back in the day when you could swim with sharks? That used to be around here. When I first came, that was an attraction. And it was literally right over here. There we go, you can get in there, Charlotte. Sharkus Giganticus, AKA really big shark. <laughs> a set of jaws from a great white just over here. There we go. <laughs> Oh, that's a good I've been photo. The <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, back when I first visited in 2014, this was a pool right here, and this was the edge of it. They obviously filled it in and just put sand in. I mean, you wouldn't know now, uh, but of course, yeah, this big feature, the submarine was there in the middle, and literally you could snorkel in here with sharks and like stingrays and all that kind of stuff. Oh, I would never do that, but that is really cool to be able to. Yeah, comment down below if you did that before. But yeah, it was literally right here. You'd queue up just right at the side. You'd start on that side. And then you'd swim all the way across over onto the other side there. I mean, they did quite a good job of kind of, you know, covering it up so you wouldn't know. But yeah, I don't know why they took it out. Um, but yeah, this is where it used to be. And continuing on then with our look around Typhoon Lagoon. And yeah, you've got some more slides just here. Humunga Kawabunga. Am I saying that right? Yeah, they take a five-story plunge down one of three enclosed high-speed body slides. I've been on these before, not a huge fan. I would never do it. <laughs> yeah, the water goes right into your face. And yeah, I would go on again, but you can't see anything on the GoPro. I've filmed on these before. Literally, it's a dark tunnel. But we'll show you these just around here because it looks quite pretty. They fit in really well. Yeah, that's the thing. These fit in great with all the rot work and planting around, as we can see. But yeah, you've got the three slides, very basic. Um, layout, of course, start up there 50 foot and come down here into the landing pool. Yeah, not the most exciting of rides, and yeah, I don't find it that uh, great really getting hit by water in the face at the bottom, but still, there it is. Do you want to go on it, Charlotte? No, I don't think so. Hey, there's some more body slides just around here, though, that I will go on. I do like these ones, and these are the storm slides, only a five minute wait. You got three different slides just here that go through caves, waterfalls, geysers, and a three story drop. So yeah, gonna head on here now. Bit of a walk up to the top, but you get some nice scenery along the way. The storm size, the nice thing, the landscaping is fantastic here. It's not really got much of an atmosphere today with it being so quiet, but of course it is good for getting on things, which is nice. Good temperature now as well. Oh, look at this boat just here. We've got a shipwreck off to the side and it says just married on there as well. Maybe me and Charlotte can have that soon. What a brilliant view over Typhoon Lagoon. Oh, I can see Charlotte sat down there at the bottom. Wow, I love all these slides out of the built into the rock work. Really impressive theming. Yeah, you can see the slides coming down over here. It's walk on. Let's go. And here we go. Nice view of Miss Tilly close up there. Of course, the boats. Stranded. We've got three different slides to choose from. Let's go. And here we go. Down on my back. Oh, you can feel the joins on the slide. That's what I'm not a fan of on body slides, you know, like these joins. Oh, oh, it's painful on the back. Oh, hey. There we go. Oh, I didn't really enjoy that. Yeah, I think it's showing its age a bit, that slide, because you could feel every single join, like the bumps that you were going over on there. Yeah, not the most uh, comfortable experience, that one. But I do like the theming up there, and of course, getting close to the boat at the top too. Loads more great theming all around here. There's so much to look at in this water park. And that's what I do really like. Oh, we can see the uh, big wave pool a bit closer. These are nice. So you kind of wash your feet off. <laughs> Crocs are good. Oh, oh, oh. It's so cold. <laughs> I thought you didn't like water features, Charlotte. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if the big waves are on again at the moment or not, but this is a good place to watch them. With the crowd being over here, it makes me think maybe they are. Did you get a good idea on the size of these big waves? I'm not too sure. There's a crowd waiting, so maybe they are on. I'm not too sure. Everyone's kind of waiting further back there. Let's see. And there it comes. Look at that. <laughs> Massive wave. And then you got a small second one. 
and a little third one coming down. If anything though, if you are all the way down here, I mean, you gotta be pretty daring to come down this bit, but if you are, you just kind of float over the top of it. Oh, like that man over there, it just sort of went over the top. It didn't go under. The worst bit in a way, it actually is being a bit further down because then you actually get the, you are the, the, the full white full part of the wave, that yeah. makes sense. You know, like you just kind of go over the top. Impressive to watch though. And yeah, they do have the times clearly advertised just over at the side there too. They're very impressive though. Is that you, Whistler? <laughs> <laughs> nice walkway, this. That's the thing with water parts, though. You don't really have to go on things to have a good time. I mean, I like going on the slide. But just walking around and taking it all in is very nice. Kind of walk through all the mountains there, which is really cool. And here's Mickey Mouse made of rubber ring. Hey, it's, so cute. it's great. I really like that. Typhoon Lagoon water park. <laughs> got some more slides around here. You've got Gangplank Falls, which is located around here. And of course, that leads down to the Forgotten Grotto, to the other side where we were just. You've got the kids area down here as well. And yeah, there is another slide just up this way that I'm going to take you all on. I don't think we can go on gangplank falls you've got to make sure you're saying that one right as it can go horribly wrong yeah, right. uh, but yeah there's a family raft slide i don't think i can do this on my own charlotte doesn't fancy this yeah, one yeah this one has got like big waterfalls that you go through and they look quite strong yeah like bigger than the ones yeah, on, on like this adventure really big, so i don't fancy giving that one a go oh that's perfectly fine yeah there is another slide around here that i can go on though so yeah, i'm gonna take that take you all on there shortly Yeah, these are also raft slides. You've got Mayday Falls and also Keelhaul Falls. So yeah, I'm going to take you on both of these now. One ride of a tube only on these ones. And just whilst I'm on my way up, here's a look at that raft slide. And yeah, it doesn't look that much from here, but yeah, there is some big waterfalls just around the side there. So yeah, completely understandable why Charlotte doesn't want to ride that one. I'm just pleased that, you know, got on some good slides today. It's been nice. Especially getting Charlotte on this adventure again. That was great. Yeah, there's some pretty big waterfalls. Charlotte would be fine if she didn't go under those, but you never know, just in case like that. Yeah, probably not the best idea for Charlotte to go on that one. I don't want to terrify her off water rides. Yeah, she's been doing really well. Don't want to scare her off. <laughs> All the theme is beautiful around here though, isn't it? Very nice. It feels like kind of old school Disney, you know, when you come around here. I mean, the theming's great. There we go. Time to shout Mayday, Mayday. <laughs> I like this. Whoa. I've never been white water rafting, but I imagine this is what it feels like. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, blimey. <laughs> oh, it's bumpy. <laughs> All the bumps in it. Oh, I'm going everywhere. <laughs> oh, this is good fun. Waterfall. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was good. <laughs> it's good fun that was. It's a bit more vicious than what I remember. And yeah, right next door, another five minute wait. Means probably walk on. It's Kill Hall Falls. Let's go on here. Thank you. Right. Hey, here we go. Kill Hall Falls. Where are we? This one looks a bit tamer. Slightly different boats on this one. Sure, it'll be okay actually on here, I reckon. Ooh. I think she quite enjoy this. This one is a massive waterfall, and she probably wouldn't. Ooh. Oh, this is quite nice. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <Not this. laughs> hey! That was good. A bit more chilled out that one was. I think you'd have been okay on there, Charlotte. Yeah, maybe next time I'll go on it. <laughs> <laughs> It'll probably be a few years though before we come back to Typhoon Lagoon. Yeah, that's the thing. Uh -huh. the, Disney do kind of neglect the water parks quite a bit. They don't have loads of investment. Yeah. And there is parts of it that feel a little bit dated now. However, I do like the old school kind of Disney feel that you get here with the theming. But really slide-wise now, it could do with some updates in my opinion. 
But still, it's a nice water park. I, you know, I do really like the feel that it's got yeah, here. Yeah, I love the theming. I think the theming is excellent, but some bits need a bit of cleaning up, I think. Yeah, a bit of TLC needed. I yeah. think for me now, you know, I've done this quite a few times without seeing Blizzard Beach. Next time we're here, I'd love to see so Blizzard I. Beach. I mean, we were really hoping to get it this time. But yeah, we're done. We've done all the slides. We've been here about three and a half hours, which for me is just enough time for a water park like this. You know, there's not, we were just talking about this off camera. Not many water parks that we can actually spend all day in. There's one out there though that we can, isn't there? Rulantica, we absolutely love that water park. Yeah, Europa Park in Germany. So good. Yeah, that's definitely our favourite water park. But yeah, look at this. We're going to go and get changed now. And of course, we'll wrap up this vlog shortly. Well, there we go, about five minutes later, all dressed and ready to get back in the theme parks. But yeah, we had a good time, haven't yeah, we? Yeah, I've really enjoyed it. It's been a little bit chilly, but it warmed up towards the end. Yeah, especially uh, this morning when we first got in. It was a little bit cold, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, it was. The water was a bit cold. <laughs> it's weird, I think, because the sun isn't out as well, and it's not as humid as it normally is, and especially the past few days where it's been really humid. We've had the fan. Even now, it doesn't feel that hot, no, does it? I do appreciate it. It's sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, yeah, it is nice. But yeah, it was a little bit chilly earlier. We've had a good time, got some slides. I do like how they allow on-ride filming as well, which is fantastic as they can capture the memories. And yeah, I enjoyed going on the slides. Highlight for me, of course, getting Charlotte on Miss Adventure. Oh, Falls. I actually quite enjoyed it, actually. It was good fun. I'm glad that you did. <laughs> yeah, and the animatronic's quite cool on there as well. It's not the longest ride, but it's just good fun. And yeah, she wasn't expecting them waterfalls. No, I was not. <laughs> yeah, it's been a few years doing quite a lot of water parks in, so I'd forgotten about that. I think that's the thing for me. Water slides, of course, I enjoy going on them, but I don't get the same adrenaline and feel as I do going on a ride roller coaster of course <laughs> uh, for me like water slides it's hard to kind of review them they all feel very similar and offer similar experiences you don't really get forces and that sort of thing and I enjoy coming on them but it's more for me walking around the water park and just seeing all the theming and like the music and it is a nice water park this I feel like there's some areas that looks a little bit dirty and could do with some updating uh, I just feel like maybe Disney's focus at the moment isn't on the water parks and really they could do with some investment yeah I they? think they need some investment I think they need a little bit of TLC yeah hopefully I mean this is probably coming towards the end of it's season so to speak now even though they the should be open all year really but they're both seasonal and uh, so this will probably have some TLC done and Blizzard Beach will open again over winter and that'll probably look really nice but uh, sadly we're not going to be able to see oh, that oh no I'm good <laughs> <laughs> but uh, there we go and of course make sure you check out all of our other Walt Disney World vlogs here on Theme Park Worldwide we've got loads including Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween oh, Party oh I'm so excited yeah that's coming up next it works out great for us coming here for half a day we can go back to the room for a bit and then we've got the Halloween party tonight uh, but thanks for watching and that leaves with one final thing to say. Get out there and keep on riding. See you in the next video.